Good morning, everyone. I hope all is well wherever you're watching this. I have been wanting to upload a morning routine for the longest time. This is how most of my mornings look like when I don't have school or any work that day, so keep that in mind. It doesn't always look this peaceful and I guess like productive, I guess you could say too. I've actually grown into liking mornings very slowly. I, I'm not the most morning person person you could meet, I guess you could say. I think now it has to do with mainly the transition. I have moved into a new place and I don't have my blackout curtains anymore. I actually ended up giving those to my parents and it's kind of a blessing and a curse because it keeps me getting up early but also getting more stuff done. So I guess it's a blessing in disguise because it leads me to being less cranky in the mornings which I think that's best for everyone, especially myself. And I get more things done so I really can't complain about that. Lately my skin has been just doing really good despite being on my period. I think it's honestly because my skin routine is like less steps, like I got my sunscreen, my snail mucin, and moisturizer because my skin definitely tends to be on the drier side. Especially upcoming these winter months, I'm really trying to prepare my skin. I do get hydrofacials every once in a while. And of course, stay hydrated and take my daily vitamins and everything. I don't take that many medicines, but just a few vitamin C and then also vitamin D too. Of course, I love my Pisces talisman, but I had to change it out for something more for everyday type wear. These layer necklaces were given to me, and I think they're super cute staple pieces. Whenever I have the time, I do enjoy making breakfast. Most of the time, I do wake up pretty hungry for for whatever reason. I don't know why. Sometimes I do get hungry at night. I'm just gonna wait till the morning. I'm gonna have a great breakfast. That's what I do. I tend to hyperfixate on like one breakfast I really like and then I get sick of it and then I have to find another breakfast I'm obsessed with. I feel like you can never really go wrong with like bagels or something, but at the same time I do want to get some protein in because that keeps me fuller longer. <laughs> to for life <laughs> I always tend to watch my comfort show which is Jane the Virgin and I feel like you can never go wrong with that show I don't know why no matter how many times I rewatch it I seem to never get sick of it an ideal morning is finishing up with a hawk or a walk with featuring my mother and we got some coffee. Usually I make coffee at home with my special machine, but if we're feeling like going out, I did invite her because it was her birthday that day. We had to felt like going out to get coffee. When I go out, I do tend to get iced coffee, but I have not perfected my ice, ice coffee at home recipe yet, so I'm still working on that. We've managed to try to do this at least once a week to catch up and really just kind of just talk about our week and stuff it's, it's a really fun thing for me to do to get my steps in get some sun and then just talk about everything well thank you guys for watching it was definitely a different type of style a type of video, but I really enjoyed it. I think it could be really fun to do something new and get out of your comfort zone. Well, thank you for watching and make sure to come back to see more videos.